hey friends welcome back to another tutorial video and in this video tutorial i will let you know how to make an rfid based door lock system using arduino and let me demonstrate you how does it works so this one is a registered rfid tag and if i scan this the door will automatically unlock so as we can see the door is unlocked and this one is not registered the door will not be open rather it will give a siren so i will add more features to this rfid door lock system so if you have visited for first time to my youtube channel then don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon to get a instant notification from me while i'm uploading new new videos like this so previously i posted a video tutorial on rfid based tag attendance system so if you haven't watched that video then do watch that video also i will provide the video link in the description as well as in i button so without any further ado let's quickly get started with this video and i'm requesting to you guys please finish 50 likes for this video so that it will be motivate me to do more video tutorials like this so without any further ado let's quickly get started with this video this project the requirements that we need are arduino nano we can even use arduino uno as well a rfid tag reader rfid tag 5 volt relay 12 volt Solenoid lock, a breadboard, a buzzer, blue LED and red LED, a couple of jumper wires. Follow this circuit diagram and make your connections. This is about the connections part. Let's move to our PC screen for coding part. So this is our code which I have already written over here. Here I have declared the SS pin, reset pin, LED pin, relay pin, buzzer pin and nothing else to be changed. And we just need to change uh, this UID. Apart from that nothing else to be changed. So let me verify the code and I just have to save so as we can see the code is compiled successfully and be before going to upload we just have to cross check the tools and we have to select the board according to my I have selected Arduino Nano uh, the project also be done with Arduino Uno as well and according to mine I have selected Arduino Nano and we have to select the bootloader and make sure that the port is selected and nothing else and this is the time to upload the code into our Arduino Uno or Nano meanwhile uploading I am again requesting to you guys if you have visited for first time to my youtube channel then don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon to get an instant notification from me while I'm uploading new new videos like this. So uh, as we can see the code is uploaded successfully into our Arduino Nano and this is time to go serial monitor and it's showing that uh, put your 
RF uh, put your card to the reader we have to scan our uh, tag so here we can get a UID and we just need to copy and we have to close this and we just have to replace here and again we have to upload the code so as we can see the code is again uh, uploaded successfully and now going to serial monitor and scanning our tag as we can see uh, the message is showing authorized access and now the time to show our project i hope you like this video then do hit that like button and also share this video among with your friends and family and also subscribe to my channel for more such videos i will see you in next video